Hey, how's it going guys? We're back with Dead Space Remake, and we're about to head into the emergency room. Let's give it a go, and let's get on broing. Ah, I see there's a lot of spikes in here for me to use how I please, yes. So I'm about to get into a fucking fight, everybody knows it. Harris is asleep after another dose of sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after more than 50 hours of waking, regardless of circumstances. Not Harris. His bizarre explanation of the events in Colony points to the same paranoia we've seen pl uh, planet side. His guilt is not in doubt. Two security officers were present when he took Dr. Chiarello Cier hostage and murdered Nurse Evans, and Harris doesn't deny his actions. But he shows no remorse. In fact, he insists there was no crime, specifically that Evans wasn't a nurse when he killed her. This is classic sociopathic behavior, but Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He is affable and friendly, able to, to empathize and offer original opinions. When questioned about Evans' murder, however, he, claims he becomes withdrawn and uncommunicative. He claims the explanation is stuck in his mind and that talking about it mixes up its message. He also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory, hallucinatory periods, again similar to those experienced by other colonists. During his long waking periods, Harris exhibits writing behavior on any available surface, claiming the dreams need to speak and that he's attempting to make it whole again. What that means, I haven't determined yet. I thought I saw a necromorph in the background while I was adjusting my glasses. God, that fucking startled me. Given the complexities of his case, I plan to reach out to my colleagues for more insight. As well you should, friend. As well you should. I'm gonna do a little scavenging, you know, before I... Is that Dr. Nicole Brennan? Loop and transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. He's seizing. Shit. Here we have some cage we left. It doesn't seem like a seizure. It seems like he's absolutely fucking losing his... losing his mind. Like, less like a seizure, and more like he's actually fucking going crazy, screaming, fucking Security going wild. But what do I know? I've never had a seizure. My dog had a seizure recently, but I did not. And I've never seen another person have a seizure in real life before. Like, in front of me, anyway. To the shower? Why don't I do that to the shower? <laughs> I was ready for some necromorphs to come popping out, so I turned the lights on again. Alright. Well, shoot, brother. Shoot. Okay. Oh, I just have to use no power in general, I see. See, just like that, he just died in a, in a handful of shots. Man, where is the plasma cutter ammo? Fucking A, I have nothing. Okay, well there's some, but that's not quite... That's not very helpful, you know. 
getting a, a meager, getting a pittance, a pittance of plasma cutter ammo does not help. But you know what? It's better than nothing. I'll take it. Fuck it. It is better than nothing. I will take it. I don't want you around. Dead bodies don't belong in morgues. They belong in hell. They belong in hell. This is some vile shit. The appearance of items in the background is really... deceiving. See, because I'm used to green meaning healing item, but now it basically means, like, could be a healing item, could be credits, or actually, I guess green just specifically means credits, and that over there is probably ammo, if I had to take a guess. Yeah, so white's ammo, green is credits, and other items just appear as themselves in the world. I guess that makes sense. That makes sense. Alright, make sure you're good to, good to know they're pro practicing proper safety procedures in this horribly bloody morgue. Excuse me? I guess bashing bodies as loudly as humanly possible is not the best option right now. <laughs> to extend the upgrade path of what? Gain access to a special upgrade. Oh, that's specifically for the plasma cutter. Oh, interesting. Alright. You keep being a baby. I'm coming to get you. I'll come and get you. I'll get you soon enough. Before that, though, I'm gonna get rid of that body. Hey, what up, son? Hey, what the fuck? Come on, man. That's fucked up. That is fucked up, bro. I shot a grenade at him and it didn't do shit! Does it have a minimum, like, arming range? Do I have to arm it? Does it need to arm before it can explode? It's fucked up, man. This feels like a place I'd get ambushed at. Security request retrieved. He left me. I woke in the dark with them scratching in the walls. <laughs> Jeez, man, take it easy. I'm kind of being dramatic. It's not like there's a station wide galactic threat. Hey, fuck you, bro! I was behind you! What the fuck? Only a couple shots left, I think. Yep. Oh! Very useful. Thank you. That is actually very useful. Oh, look at all the- look at the healing! Look at the stuff! Mercer, this is Terrence Kine. You were in surgery, so I left this with Warwick. Okay. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Aegis 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Mercer. Maybe I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Brent Harris, might be our last hope. Jeez. 
Jesus Christ. He really went down the middle there. <laughs> That's your reaction, Isaac? Ugh. God. <laughs> this is actually his reaction to somebody slitting their own throat directly in front of him. Ugh. Jeez. Come on, man. <laughs> what an inconvenience. Good lord. Okay. Well. So much pulse rifle ammo. Can I get anything but... I should have dumped my pulse rifle off, but it is still really good at killing enemies. Like... Like, even a group of enemies would fucking die to the, uh, to the secondary fire. It's just, it's so much. I don't know. It don't matter, I guess. It don't really matter. Let's go! Yikes! Huh? I don't remember that. <laughs> Hell yeah, making use of them pulse rifle rounds for sure. Where would I find? Ah, I see. I've been blessed with sight. Let's go, baby. I've been blessed with sight. Yes. Okay. Let's do it. <sighs> Let's do it. Oh, I'll take an oxygen refill. Thank you. Hell yeah. Thank you. Anything else in here I can scrounge before I before the inevitable? What is that? Oh, that's just a light. I guess that would make sense. I guess that would just be a light. Only a light. Look at that! Beautiful. Everything I ever imagined it would be. And more! Look at that! Man, I got so many bombs I can blast off. These fools ain't got a chance. They ain't got no chance. They ain't got one single chance. Oh my god! Yeah, there you go. Fuck him up, Isaac. Give him something. Give him something to really cry about. Ah, don't run after me! Jesus Christ! on there I can disarm them and pick them up again god damn whoa 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 back off uh oh I'm about to die this is the first death coming up here this is the first death coming up here Yikes! 
Yikes! Oh, I'm out. What the fuck was that, bro? Come on now. Really? Bro, look how much damage he did! That's fucked up. Oh, I got, well, I got another big med kit back, so, you know, I'm fine with that. That's okay, I'm good. And I didn't waste too much ammo, either. Honestly, that's fucked up. I, I made a net positive am of ammo, I, I guess you could say. Despite the fact that I lost plenty of it trying to shoot them with bombs that didn't activate. Like, fucking A, man. I really used up a lot of the bomb- my- my fucking ammo there. A lot. Relatively speaking, I guess. I didn't have a whole lot. Isaac, what's your status? Whew. You have the captain's rig. Fuck me! Ugh. Transmitting notes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chen. God, maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels security when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. Okay, cool. That sounds like a plan, actually. That sounds pretty good to me. And man, fuck this glowing necromorph head, man. But fuck that shit. Oh, security clearance is now level one. Hmm. Interesting. Is there maybe somewhere I didn't see when we were coming up here? Is there another place I could have gone? What about changing the floor? What if I go to floor? Wait, where am I at? Floor one? What about floor two? Okay, I haven't been to floor two. What about floor four? What about floor four? What about floor? Floor. What about floor four? Or, wait, which one? Yeah, floor four. Oh, that was locked. Okay, so I can go back there, but this is where I need to go is the security station. This was also locked. Oh, but that wasn't locked by security. See, okay, I can see it now. Security doors locked and yada yada yada. Okay, uh... So the floor I'm on just doesn't have any security locks on it. It's just that one. So what about floor five? So I know I ran into some shit that needed security level one before, although where it is I can't remember. Uh, I guess I'll have to be finding out in a moment, yep. Yeah. Hooey! Isaac. <laughs> what the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. Through the flight deck? I mean, I guess that makes sense. Makes more sense than a magical tram that can just take you wherever the fuck from wherever the fuck. Oh, behind me, I see. Man, I... Is this the same place I was before? Yeah, it is. Is this level 2 or level 1? Yes, give me the level 1! Yes, give me level 1! What about in here? Is there a necromorph that's about to pop up out of here? Like right behind me. Clearance confirmed. Oh, 1200. Give me the mother load of money, baby. I sort of want to turn the lights on in here again, but I also just don't really give a shit. Am I gonna come back here? Chances are probably not. Ah, right, no ammo. I forgot. Kind of an important factor in determining whether or not I get the hell back here. Clearance. Yes, give me the nodes! I will update my damage. 
Uh, how am I going to update my damage, though, is the question. There doesn't seem to be... Doesn't seem to be an upgrade station for a minute. For a minute. I'm moving this to storage for sure, man. Absolutely. That's also going to storage. So we're at 150 bullets. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, okay, okay. I got plenty of stuff that I can sell, but do I want to sell it? Not necessarily. Ugh. I have six power nodes. That's five I can spend on whatever I want. Oh, did I, uh... Did I not ever do the side mission? Track this objective, thank you. Oh, yes. I forgot. Well, I don't exactly have any particular love for the pulse rifle as of yet, but uh, I will follow Nicole's hologram and see where that takes me. Where's Nicole at, goddammit? I'm gonna play this again. Loop and transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. Oh, Shit. Maybe I have some PHP left. Why? What is with them noises? What be with them noises, you hear? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, big money. Nicole's rolling in the fucking credits, bro. Medical log. Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now, it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need... Wait, where's that report from engineering? Here. The engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. Yeah, for show. Okay. So is that the end of that side mission? Find autopsy location in engineering. Okay, so I gotta go to engineering anyway. Alright, cool. Well, you know what? That's fair. That's fine. Uh, but I do need a workbench, is what I need. And I don't think that there's one here. I think the only other place I could find a workbench, because I don't want to go back, it would be... Yeah, it looks like a workbench right there. Okay, well, I'll just head back that way then. I'll probably be able to pick up some boxes and shit on my way too. So I will be right back. Give me one second, I'm gonna head over to the other side. Oh shit! What the fuck? What you doing, bro? Okay. Oh, oh, he came back. Gotcha. Well, nice. Thank you. Good to see you, sir. Damn, I almost gave him a standing stomp for that one, man. Fuck. What a fucking nut job. I don't know why I came back here. I gotta be honest with you. There's nothing back this way. There's nothing. There is nothing back this way. Why did I come here? I got a little extra money, but I didn't even pick up enough money to make up for the bullets I just spent. I'm guessing there's a necromorph around the corner here, too. Maybe not? Maybe it was all a ruse. Uh, yeah, I see a box in there. Alright. 
So the whole level one clearance thing ought to get me some leeway there. Man, fuck your level 2 bullshit. Let's go see if this is a level 2 as well. Yep, it's a level 2. I'm glad I wasted my time on that one. Tell you what. Tell you what, man. Okay, well, let's just get to upgrading then. I'm sure I would have found a bench moving forward through the game rather than backward. But... I didn't want to... didn't want to risk it. Yes, an additional power node has been salvaged. A new special ability is accessible, an additional power node has been salvaged. Fuck yeah, baby, I got seven power nodes now. Special rack? For what? Greatly increases ammunition capacity. Hell yeah. Well, that would be pretty friggin' great if uh, I had a way to get to it. So I could spend three downwards, get capacity and damage again. Which would be good. Um, or three that way and get reload as well. But I'm not really concerned about that too much. So I can get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I could spend seven here. Or I could get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or I could do some damage for the pulse rifle, which would be pretty good, honestly. Like, I'm getting so much ammo for the Pulse Rifle, but how much more ammo am I going to get? I could spend four here. I don't really want to spend four here. I might do two. So if I do two here, and then I do one, two, three, four, I get six. But I won't get anything else for my, uh, for my suit here if I do that. Yeah. I think I'll just do this. I think this is the way to go. Maybe I should do it. Maybe I should do more cap. If I do more capacity, then I at least, you know, don't save or use as much inventory space on ammo because I could just load more of it up. Uh, but at the same time, I got more damage for the plasma cutter. That actually increased my damage by 20 points that time, I think, instead of just 10. Like, the first one did 10. The next one did, uh, did 20. So that's actually a pretty big jump in damage. So in three shots, I can accomplish almost what I can in four. It's not so bad. In four shots... Yeah, well, whatever. Okay, uh, maybe I should spend it on one of these, I guess. I know oxygen's gonna be kind of important later on. Like, there's definitely gonna be sections I'm gonna need, or want to have more oxygen for. Plus, I need the adjacent nodes to unlock access to these other ones, but do I care? Do I care? Is the question. Man, we're getting down to the nitty gritty. I'll just do capacity again. Oh, I can also reset my nodes. Hell yeah. Does it cost anything? Ah. 5,000 5, credits. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, we're just gonna back up out of that one real quick. Hell yeah, son. And I got a full clip, too. Damn straight. Piss off, man. I'm sick of your scary, creepy noises, okay? I actually like them, but I'd rather you didn't. Because I just uh, I don't want to hear it. You're going to make me anxious, and if I get anxious, I'm going to be really upset. Okay. Oh shit! What the fuck? Hey, 
And fuck you. Okay, interesting. So enemies can just spawn if you leave an area. So in, a, in essence, I guess I was sort of right in the idea that the enemies just kind of, you know, show up, I guess. So there is always a reason to be... Oh, a gold semiconductor. Hell yeah, baby. <laughs> got a couple bronze. I got some gold. Hell yeah, my man. That's like uh, $7,000 worth of shit right there. And if I were to sell some of these med packs as well. Man, I got so much money. But I don't need to worry about that right now. No, what I do need to worry about is getting a little more ammo in my inventory. About 18 shots. Thank you. Okay. Haha, <laughs> 6,900. Fuck yeah, baby. Alright, well. That's good ammo for now. The efficiency of ammo has definitely reached a, a point above where it was before. Because now I can kill enemies in less shots. Obviously, that's what you want. Seven shots. Not bad. Don't you pop out of a vent, you son of a bitch. Uh, where do I want to go? Nice. You can actually change? That's interesting. Alright, cool. Hell yeah, baby. But yeah, you see what I mean. Like, look, this ship is fucking massive, dude. You need a tram to get around. There are five different decks on this bitch. Like, this is a big ship. <sighs> Alright. With no loading screens, either. Honestly, I think that's probably just due to the idea that I've got, like, an M2 in my system. Maybe not. Maybe an SSD would be just the same performance. But it's actually really fucking cool that it just loads so fast. Like, what a blessing. I forgot about you folks. Okay. What's through here? Have I already been through here? Oh yeah, that's to medical. God, I'm an idiot. I've, I have definitely already been through there. Okay. Well, no more beating around the bush with this. I've got abundance. I've got an abundance of ammo for both guns right now, and by abundance, I mean more than none. So uh, let's go ahead and use up the pulse rifle while we've got the chance. I'm not going back in there. There's no reason to go in there. Security reporting did have a security recording, you are absolutely correct. Why am I going through this way? What 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 is the point of being here again? This is the third time I've been here, man. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Entering zero gravity. You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. Damn. Chapter 2 is completed, hell yeah. Chapter 3, let's get it, baby. I'm gonna check out the Kellyan while I have a chance. Maybe there's... Maybe there's something... Something I can use. Bronze semiconductor. 
Fuck yeah, baby. And the Kellyan is fucking huge for only having to shuttle like five people around. They had an absolutely massive ship to take with them, tell you what. More ammo, always appreciated, thank you. Okay, so far, plenty of goodies. Plenty of goodies to be found around the Kellyan, but not necessarily on the Kellyan itself. Which is uh, too bad, but uh, I kind of figured they'd put something in for, you know, our ride home. Like, undoubtedly one of the most important... Oh, can I get in? No, I can't. Okay, I see. I see. It's all blocked up by wreckage, by rubble and ruin. I'm sorry, this is going to take me a second. I really just want to find all the goodies that I can. I am playing on hard. This is going to be a struggle. I need every advantage I can get. Every advantage I can get. Alright, plenty of money, thank you. And even the boosters on his on his boots sound like monsters. Everything about this game and its universe is just horrifying. That's not what I wanted! Fuck! God damn it, son of a bitch! Keep pressing F to interact with the shit. You gotta be fucking kidding me. God damn it. Son of a bitch. I just wasted my healing. Well, there is a power cell here, I guess. So I need to find out just where that might be. Oh, right there. Well, interesting. Literally the only place it could possibly go. Okay, cargo rail tracks, loading shutter. I'm about to get attacked. I always feel like I'm about to get attacked. Level three security clearance required. How does the captain not have anything beyond a level one security clearance? Um, that or maybe I don't have. I don't use the captain's clearance. Maybe I just use the captain's clearance to give myself a higher clearance. I guess that makes more sense than anything. Fuck yeah, baby! So much ammo! And a, a graphical bug. Okay. See, that's the kind of shit that would make somebody be like, <gasps> a Bad game! You know, just because of a fucking something stupid like that. I don't even know why I'm bothering with this, but like, that pisses me off so much when something simple and small like that could make somebody so outraged that they would give a game a bad review just because one little thing was out of place and their perfect little rendition in their own head of how the game should be. It's like, I've noticed, what, two? So far, two graphical bugs in the game. The first one was because I kept fucking around and mashing menu buttons, which you wouldn't even experience unless you did that. And the second one was because I opened lockers really fast, which, you know, would not probably happen to most people, I guess. Game never lets up with suspense, I'll tell you what. It's 
Is there something in here? Is there more to this? Have I been a fool? Or is this just a foreshadowing of things to come in the future? That which it just might be. Okay, I don't think there's anything else left. I don't think there's anything else left for me to discover here. Okay, where am I going? Oh yeah, way the fuck out there. Gotcha. I'm sorry, where am I going? Uh, object instructions are not very clear. I can barely see it. Oh, I see. I see now. Alright, I'm just being a dummy. I was just being what one would call a dummy. But I see stuff in the distance. I see something crazy. What is that? No, not that. What is that? What is that? I want that. Maybe it's an important item. I'm just being dumb. Volker's rig. Uh, Isaac, chill out, bro. You got 20 seconds of... You got full oxygen now. Take it easy, man. God damn. Oh, shit! I'm being attacked! Like I thought I would. Well, fuck you, motherfucker. You filthy goddamn necromorphs. You filthy necromorph bastards. Alright, we good? Are we good? Alright, cool. Can I take a look at this now? Take a look at the rig I picked up? No? Okay. Notice the screen space gets darker when the flashlight's in use. That's uh, an interesting and fucked up mechanic. <laughs> they would make the screen, the entire screen, darker just because you're using a flashlight. Works, I guess. Works for me. I don't mind. Just makes it more intense when you're already in the dark and you. Oh, more of you. I see. Are you fucking serious, man? Hey, give me a break. Isaac, chill the fuck out, man. You're losing your mind. Man's actually losing his marbles over nothing. sealing up all right well might as well stay and watch I guess Oh, I might run out of oxygen. <laughs> it's just occurring to me I might be in danger. Exiting zero gravity. Exiting zero gravity. 
There you go. Take a deep breath, Isaac. You, you've earned it, I guess. Being the crybaby that you are. <laughs> Man's actually fucking losing it. Oh, shit! Oh, you're right there. My bad. You're Cree! You're glitching out, buddy! Take it easy! Your doctor told you this might happen! Oh, there you go, Isaac. Get into it, man. Absolutely fucking go bonkers on this guy. It's always two steps forward, three steps back in this game. I pick up ammo, I lose all the ammo I picked up, and then I pick up more ammo, so I'm, like, just slightly ahead of where I was before I used it, used the ammo. Now, what is Volker's rig all about? I picked up their rig, but why? Like, what does... How does that benefit me in any way? Key items? What do you mean, what key items? Show me the key items. Scratched, but functional core of Hangar Supervisor Vol Volker's rig. Okay. So, maybe I just picked that up by accident, and it'll come in handy in a minute, so I won't have to go all the way back. Organic growth and engineering. Adding this to my maintenance priority request, maybe something in writing will make them pay attention. That identified growth reported elsewhere on the ship has reached engineering. Not even medical knows what the hell this stuff is. It looks like someone threw their guts up all over the walls and smells about the same. It's spreading faster than we can cut it up, which is pretty disgusting in itself. It's already busted the cargo lift, and it's getting into the engine spoke. If we can't find a way to stop it soon, it'll be all over the main engine chamber by the day after tomorrow. Meantime, I'm heading to Mining Dick. They've got PFM 100s in storage for ice mining, and they can sh they can spare the fuel. Maybe cauterizing this stuff will do the trick. Just hope it doesn't smell worse when it's on fire. Well, bud, I, th I don't think you'll have a... I don't think... Look, if you burn a human body, it smells terrible. I can't imagine burning an organic substance... <laughs> This is gonna smell better if it already smells bad. Orbital position compromised. Correct course immediately. Is this a safe area? Relatively, anyway. It is. Look at that. And a med kit, a small med kit. Fuck yeah, baby. Man, things are looking up me right now. Engineering log. Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple reporting. Christ, I still can't believe the Chief is gone. It's all fallen apart since the Captain died. Everyone down here is on their last nerve. We thought the rioting was the worst of it. So those things came through the vents. Their faces. Fuck, those were my lunch buddies, Liz's friends, old boyfriends. And out of nowhere, the engines are screwed. Primaries laboring for hemorrhaging fuel, but if I know why. I'm taking Danvers to the fuel depot to fix it. Gotta keep the team focused and on track. Temple out. Alright, Temple. Oh, man. You got any schematics for me? No? Okay, well, it is what it is. Okay, I'll move that to storage. Uh, how much ammo do I have in storage at this point? I've got, I've got a little ammo in there. Okay. So I'll do with 170, that gives me a little over, that's like two and a half clips right there. Or magazines, I guess. Two, hundred, two and a half magazines of this ammo. Uh, and then I've got quite a bit in storage right now. 10,000 flat credits, as it is. What the hell is that? Oh, I can buy these if I had a little more. Had a little more. Which is actually, uh... Two f on top of being upgrades is two free nodes, I think. Two free power nodes just for using them. That's not a bad deal. Oh, huh, huh. Kinetic auto loader probably means it's gonna be like real fast or have like real big ammo. Real big ammo pile. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> There's one thing I want to get out of the way first before anything else, which is saving the game and then unfortunately calling it an end here. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you being here. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you got to do, and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Take care, friends.